Hi buddies, welcome back. I have the Samsung Galaxy A14 5G with me today and together we will set it up and go through the first steps. So this is the phone from the front and this is it from the back. This is the camera and, and then we go ahead and press on the power on button. Now we get welcome. We can make emergency calls here or go to the accessibility part and do some settings and then we can click on start insert a sim card yeah we will do that later in a separate video we can choose our language here now and we'll go with english and click on next and and now we come to the next slide for your review check out the privacy policy to see how we manage your data I agree to the end user license agreement. Um, I agree to the sending of diagnostic data. You don't have to agree to that. Um, agreeing to the end user license is mostly enough. Choose a Wi Fi network. You want to connect to Wi Fi to like use WhatsApp, the Play Store, and whatever else. So now we're connected to Wi Fi, service provider setup, checking service provider information. This could take a few minutes. All right. Your phone needs to restart to set up features and services from your service provider. All right. Restart. Copy apps and data. You can choose to transfer your apps, photos, contacts, Google accounts, and more. If you click on next, it will show you what you need to do next. But sometimes it's nice to like start fresh without any old data. So I'm gonna say don't copy. Sign in with your Google account. Um, you also want to do that to like fully use the Play Store and stuff. Um, if you don't have an account, you can create one here. I'm gonna put in my email now. We publish the Google Terms of Service so that you know what to expect as you use our services. By clicking I agree, you agree to these terms. You're also agreeing to the Google Play Terms of Service to enable discovery and management of apps. Um, remember the Google Privacy Policy describes how Google handles information generated as you use Google services. You can always visit your Google account uh, to take a privacy checkup or to adjust your privacy privacy controls. You can say don't add this account now, but if you want to add a Google account, you need to say, oh, I agree. Getting account info. Tap to learn more about each service, such as how to turn it on or off later. Data will be used according to Google's privacy policy. Use basic device backup, use locations and usage in diagnostic data, install updates and apps. Um, the allow scanning will turn off automatically if you turn off the use location. It can only be turned on and off if the location is on. And then you can read through it and accept if you're done. Now you can choose your search engine. If you click on these little arrows, you have more information about them. And you can also go ahead and reconfigure your home screen and Chrome later. Um, so I'm going to say next, protect your phone. We'll do that in a separate video. There we will set up a like pin um, and the fingerprints and stuff. So we're going to skip that. And now access your system with Hey Google. Um, skip, skip not now, um, but you can totally go ahead and do so. Getting your phone ready. Get recommended apps. Apps will be downloaded when you're connected to Wi-Fi. More information here, but we can't really like disable them. So we need to click on next. Samsung account um, to sync apps, uh, share files and stuff. I'm gonna skip that one now. Oh, skip, skip. And, and now Samsung services, customization service, nearby device scanning, sure. You all set up, finish. And, and now we can discover and install great apps. Um, press continue to discover great apps for your device. Or free, no, I don't want to do that. Oh, there's a later in the corner here, it's gray. Pretty sneaky. It looks like we can't press yes. I'm gonna press it anyway. And it worked, so you can press yes, even though it's gray. How kind of sneaky of them to make it that color so we will get these apps. And um, now we're on home screen. We have some pre-installed apps here and then this is the initial setup of the Samsung Galaxy A14 5G. What's that now? All right, 
Uh, so that's the initial setup. I hope you liked it, hope it helped. If so, thumbs up, share, and subscribe, and I hope to see you next time. Bye.